Good morning, everyone, and morning. welcome once again to Nabahakma Ministries 30 Days of Fasting and Prayer and Consecration. Amen. We thank God for waking us up this morning and allowing us to see this brand new day. And we have a praise within us, we have a reverence and an honor for him within us just for his goodness and his mercy toward us since we have gotten up out of our beds. Hallelujah. So Amen. we Hallelujah. just thank God for his goodness to us and for his grace and his mercy. Once again, our theme for the month is Psalm 2 and 8. And it says, ask of me and I shall give thee the heathen, the nations, the people for thine inheritance and the uttermost parts of the earth for thy possession. So once again, it falls my lot to uh, just gather up everything that we've prayed about this week, and we're going to pray through it and begin the next week of fresh. So Father, initially, we just thank you, Lord God, again, for just waking us up this morning and allowing us to see this beautiful day that you made. We rejoice in it and we are glad, we are thankful. We thank you that all is well and that everyone is well. And we thank you, God, that those who are not well shall be well. So God, yeah, we yeah. just all just give you praise and we give you glory and we give you thanks as yeah. we enter into your gates with thanksgiving, as we enter into your court with praise, we will be thankful unto you and we will mm -hmm. bless your name because you're good your mercy is everlasting and your truth endures to all generations. So thank you, Lord God, as we enter into your divine presence. Amen. Hallelujah. And so we start off with this passage in Psalm 116, verse 2. Sorry. Now stuff wants to slide on me, but we're not going to slide today. All right, I'm not going to be distracted today. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. <laughs> so Psalm 116 verse 2 says, Because he hath inclined his ear unto me, therefore I will call upon him as long as I live. And I know there's something else that tags on in word that says, I will sing praises to him while I have my being. My meditation of him shall be sweet. I will be glad in the Lord. So, Father, we thank you that we can call on your name. We thank you, Lord God, that no other name under heaven can save us. Neither is there salvation in any other, Lord God, for there is none other name under heaven given among men whereby we must be saved. Wherefore, God, you also ex highly exalted the Lord and given him a name which is above every name that at the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow, every tongue shall confess of things in heaven and things in earth and things under the earth. And every tongue should confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. So God, we thank you that there is no jealousy or competition in your Godhead. We thank you that when we call you Lord, you will bend down to listen to us and hear what we have to say. When we call you Father, you will bend down and listen to us and hear what we have to say. When we say, Holy Spirit, you will bend down and listen to us and hear what we have to say. And so as long as there is breath in us, there is hope. And because we hope, we pray. The songwriter said, I will not be silent. I will always worship you as long as I am breathing I will always worship you. Hallelujah. Amen. So we will make declarations today and utterances before you, Father. We will speak what you have said. So we thank you for the nations. We thank you for the uttermost parts of the earth. We thank you for those who, who do not know you and we claim them as our inheritance. We thank you, God, for our faculties this morning. We thank you for our right mind and the activities of our limbs. We thank you, God, that our organs and our tissues and our bones and our yes. ligaments and our vessels and everything that makes us up is in your divine order and that all is working together for our good and for your glory. God, we prayed unto you, Lord, our God, and we've made our confession and we say, oh, Lord, the great and dreadful God, keeping the covenant and mercy to them that love you and to them that keep your commandments. We have sinned, God, and we have committed iniquity and 
we have done wickedly and we have rebelled even by departing from your precepts and your judgments. Neither have we hearkened unto your servants, the prophets, which spake in your name to our kings, our princes, and our fathers, and to all the people of the land. O oh Lord, righteousness belongs to you, but unto us confusion of faces as at this day to the men of Judah and to the inhabitants of Jerusalem and unto all Israel that are near and that are far off through all the countries where you have driven them because of their trespass, that they have trespassed against you. O oh Lord, to us belongeth confusion of face, to our kings, to our princes, and to our fathers, because we have sinned against you. To the Lord our God belong mercies and forgivenesses, Though we have rebelled against you, neither have we obeyed the voice of the Lord our God to walk in his laws, which he set before us by this, the servants, by his servants and the prophets. Now, therefore, O God, hear the prayer of your servants and our supplications and cause your face to shine upon your sanctuary that is desolate for the Lord's sake. O God, incline your ear and hear Open your eyes and behold our desolations and the city which is called by your name. For we do not present our supplications before you for our own righteousness, but we present them for your great mercies. Oh, Lord, hearken and do not defer, not for thine own sake, our, our God, for your city and your people are called by your name. And Father, as we come before you, we repent of our wrongs. Forgive us, Lord God, and cleanse us of all unrighteousness as we approach your throne. We thank you for doing it, Father, because you are our refuge. You are our strength. You are a very present help in trouble. God, we pray concerning these wars that are going on in the earth, oh God. We pray for peace. We pray for preservation of life and property. We've heard of the carnage that has happened prior to today, oh God. And we pray for peace peace. We pray for preservation of life, and we pray for preservation of property. Father, we pray against the lawlessness that is going on all over the land. Forgive us of our iniquities. Forgive us of our transgression. Creation is groaning and waiting for the manifestation of the sons of God. And Father, we are here in the name of Jesus. There is desolation in our cities and our nation, and we pray for mercy concerning our governmental systems. Let your peace be upon Israel and Palestine and Jamaica and Syria and Russia and Ukraine and in every nation. Father, manifest the fullness of your presence in the name of Jesus. We pray for those that are in authority Father, turn their hearts in your hands and cause them to obey your will. You said yeah. if my people, which are called by my name, would humble themselves and pray, seek your face and turn from their wicked ways, that you would hear from heaven, you would forgive our sin, and, we, and you would heal our land. And Father, mm -hmm. our land needs healing today. Oh, yes, so we Lord. thank you for doing it, Lord God. We pray against physical, spiritual, and financial oppression. May your guidance be in the nations, and may your righteousness be found in the nations. Anoint us, Lord God, to hear you. Oh, God, make provision out of every type of bondage. Let our prayers that we pray even today and beyond be a sweet-smelling savor in your nostrils. We receive the gifts that you have for us, Lord, and we will operate under an open heaven. We shall be a crown of glory and a royal diadem in your hands. Oh, God, our light shall not be hidden under a bushel. We will be shining lights for you everywhere we go in the name of Jesus. Foreigners yeah. will bring their treasures to us because the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof the world and they that dwell therein. We are your children and we are partakers of the inheritance of the saints in the light. So may our angels and our destiny help us move our prayers. Our Father, our Creator, may any powers that are fighting against our destiny die by Holy Ghost fire. 
may any powers fighting against our destiny die by Holy Ghost fire. Father, bring us into favor with all who decide our advancement. Bring us into favor in matters of litigation. Bring us into favor with anyone who has the ability to decide our advancement. Anoint them, Lord God, as they speak our name. Anoint them, O oh God, and may your favor be advanced to us through our destiny helpers. Hallelujah, Jesus. We reject the spirit of the tailbearer. We reject beneath because we are the head only and not the tail. Let Amen. this mind be in us that was also in Christ Jesus. We thank you that none of us will be lost. None of our family and friends and loved ones will be lost. We claim them for our inheritance. We will all be found in you and we will do greater works. We will operate where you need us to operate. We will go where you want us to go. We will speak what you want us to speak and we will do what you want us to do. Yeah. Oh God, may our feet follow your commands and be anointed. May our ears and our hands and all of us be anointed in the yes, name God. of Jesus. Yes, Lord, Lord, break our chains. We submit to your spirit's leading. God, may our pathway for advancement be smooth. May mm -hmm. our advancement be like heaping coals of fire on the head of our enemies. May the world recognize your moving in our lives and be saved thereby. We receive the anointing to excel. Oh, God, catapult us forward in every area of our lives and cause us to excel in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Father, help us identify and deal with our weaknesses. Help us to look to you and your word for the solutions to all of our issues. We will be in health and we will prosper even as our soul prospers. We bind the strong man delegating against our lives. Mm -hmm. Every tongue that rises against us is condemned for this is the heritage of the servants of the Lord. We bind the spirit of strife. Your word will go ahead of us and it will accomplish all things for us. We will seize our miracles. We will walk in our prophetic destinies. Marginal success will not be ours because we walk in the covenantal blessings of Abraham and Isaac and Jacob and in the covenantal blessings of Jesus Christ. Inhabit our praises and our blessings, oh God. We are your righteousness and we are your covenantal children. Hallelujah, Jesus. Amen. Protect us, Father. Uncertainty has been spread across our land, but we stand upon the word of God. You have not given us a spirit of fear, but you have given us power. You've given us love and you've given us a sound mind. We are the children of God and we will not entertain fear in any form, hallelujah. We thank you that the God of peace has crushed Satan under his feet. What shall we then say to these things? If you, God, be for us, who can be against us? You that spared not your own son, but delivered him up for us all. How shall you not with you also freely give us all things? Who shall lay anything to the charge of your elect? It is you, God, that justifies us. Glory to your name. Who is he that condemneth? It is Christ that died, yea, rather that is risen, who is even at your right hand, who also makes intercession for us. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Tribulation can't separate us. Distress can't separate us. Persecution can't separate us. Famine and nakedness and peril and sword cannot and will not separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus, our Lord. As it is written for your sake, we are killed all the day long. We are accounted as sheep for the slaughter. Nay, in all these things, we are more than conquerors through you that loved us. We can't lose with the stuff that you use. Hallelujah. As it is written for your sake, God. We thank you, Lord, 
that you have delivered us from the power of darkness and you have translated us into the kingdom of your dear son in whom we have redemption through his blood, even the forgiveness of sins. Jesus is the image of you, Father, the invisible God, the firstborn of every creature. Holy Spirit, penetrate every area of our lives. We will not fear danger. We will not fear havoc. We will trust in the name of the Lord. We revoke every attachment to fear and anxiety. The enemy remains under our feet and we have the victory. We live and we walk in victory. We walk by our faith and not by the things that, are, that we see around us, not by the things that are being spoken into our ears. We walk by faith in the son of God that loves us and gave himself for us. We step over craggy places, standing on the stability of your word. The enemy of our lives has already been conquered. So we are already overcomers by your blood and by your right hand. We render the works and strategies of the enemy powerless and useless. Every demonic influence that would touch our natural eyes or our spiritual eyes, May the fire of God blind you in the name of Jesus. Yes, Hallelujah. Lord, in the name of Jesus. We will Glory. see. We will have dreams. We will have visions. We will walk in our prophetic calling. And goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. And we Amen. will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Oh, God, hide your people from the hand and works of the enemy. We abort every word and every trap the enemy has set against us. Send hmm. confusion and disorganization into the enemy's camp. Expose every foe that is pretending to be a friend in the name of Jesus. Anoint our mouths, Lord God, and fill them with the argument of heaven. Fill yeah. them with holy boldness. When the enemy recognizes who we are, may they flee seven ways. May they flee from us, Lord, wherever we go. When we speak your word, may it be like lightning and sharp as a sword. May what we speak connect us, connect to its intended purpose. Whatever we say, may it connect to the purpose for which we speak it in Jesus' name. God, may our houses of worship be your habitation. May we be houses of prayer and may we be your habitation in Jesus' name. We, may we be a sanctified kingdom united together for the glory of God. Any demonic forces and enemies militating around us at our houses of worship, Father, we send the fire of God to consume them. We yes. cancel every seductive spirit released to cause your people to fall. Help us to focus on you, Lord God. Help us to focus on glory and on heaven. May those in our pulpits and those that are sitting in our offices of government, may they not be seduced by any seductive spirit of the flesh. May your peace be in the nations, oh God. May the strong man be unseated and filled with the Holy Ghost and power. Oh Lord, we ask you to enter into the conflicts that are going on in Israel and Russia and Sudan and Syria and in India and in Jamaica and in, in Ukraine and in the United States of America, in Nigeria and Barbados and even to the uttermost parts of the earth. Turn the hearts of the government to you, oh God. These earthly kingdoms have sinned, God, but we know that your kingdom is sure so that there be peace on the continents. Let the peace of God reign. Forgive us again, God, for our lawlessness and heal our land. Forgive us, God, for forsaking your name. Forgive us for neglecting the place of prayer. So many of us who, who claim your name are neglecting the place of prayer. Forgive us, O oh God, in the name of Jesus. May we see your power and your might demonstrated in our lives. May this generation see your power and your might demonstrated in their lives. And Father, continue to bless Nava Hotman Ministries. Continue to bless Pastor Cheryl and Minister Andrew and Ma Perlina and all 
of the others that work along with them, Miss Sylvia, Miss Alicia. Bless them, bless their families, oh God. Bless everything that concerns them and cause them to triumph and to overcome in every area of their lives in the name of Jesus. Father, cause us to arise and take our places in your kingdom. Hallelujah. We rebuke the sin cycles that we have in our lives. We rebuke generational sin cycles and things that were inflicted upon us even in our innocence. Lord, place our names on the lips of intercessors everywhere. Help us to also call on your name, O oh Lord, and help us to see and carry out our divine spiritual assignment. Oh Lord, help us to know and to recognize that we are the redeemed. May we see that greater is he that is in us, glory to your name, than he that is in the world. Oh God, our hearts are deceitful and desperately wicked without you, but you are the lifter of our heads and you are more than able to accomplish what concerns us. So Father, let no weapon formed against us prosper. Oh Lord, may no rocket penetrate our territory or any other. You are our shield and you are our buckler, Lord. Help us to show forth your glory in the earth. Every enterprise that is crafted by the enemy, we destroy it by your word and by your blood. All evil records that are written against us, evil words that have been said against us, we declare that the record is erased this morning and shattered to pieces in the name of Jesus. God, we thank you for smoothing our path to the top by your hands of fire. Remove all human agents that are bent on stopping us. Remove any demonic forces. We will leap over walls. We will run through troops in Jesus' name. God, remove strife in our governmental system. We destroy and we cancel every assignment of the enemy, whether it comes through human agents or whether it comes through demonic forces. Help us, God, each and every day not to be conformed to this world and not to speak like others. We will speak only what you speak, Lord. Annihilate unprofitable words that have been spoken against us. Annihilate unprofitable words that we have spoken and let your word destroy every controversy against us, God. Let every controversy be settled in our favor. Reverse every unprofitable lie spoken against us and every unprofitable question that has been spoken against us. Reverse every unprofitable attachment in the name of Jesus. May the mark of your divine presence be seen in our lives and may your name continue to be on our tongues. Oh yeah. God, we thank you for your benefits. We thank you for your excellent care of us. We thank you for your covenant, Lord. And we reject any force or ancillary ideas that would cause us to walk out of your will for our lives. We will stay. We will remain planted in the house of the Lord. We will remain planted in the kingdom of God. Lord, yeah. we thank you that the devourer is rebuked for our sake. He cannot destroy our fruitful ground. Move us out of debt and into prosperity. We thank you, Lord God, for divine debt cancellations for us in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. And every strong man that may be holding our things in hostage, we declare that we are free and all things belong to us in Christ Jesus. We thank yes. you, God, that the hold of the strong man will not prosper against us. The work of our hand will return us to prosperity. Let the spirit of laziness be turned around, Lord. We command our bodies to do what you created them to do in the name of Jesus. Our vines will not fail. Whatever we plant will flourish in Jesus' name. We will be called blessed because we are blessed and we are a fruitful land, glory to God. We are a prosperous land. We Amen. will not fall and we will not fail because you are holding us up, hallelujah. We apply the blood of Jesus and we will continue to rise in Jesus' name, hallelujah. 
Lord, you are worthy of our praise. And we thank you for continuing to give us everything that we need. Thank you for our daily strength and for our energy. Early in the morning, we bring our prayers and praises to you, Lord. Bring our will and our emotions and all things concerning us into alignment with you, O oh Lord. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Lord, let your kingdom come. Let your will be done in earth yeah. as it is in heaven. We are seeking your agenda to be done on earth. Give us this day our daily bread. Provide for us as you always do, Lord, and we will thank you for doing it continuously. Thank you for giving us everything that we need. Thank you for our daily portions. Thank you for an abundant measure of wisdom and understanding. We thank you for peace, your perfect peace. You didn't just give us peace. You gave us perfect peace that surpasses yes. all Amen. understanding. Thank you, Lord. So God, thank we you, thank Lord. you for helping us to release and to forgive others. Give us hearts like little children's hearts that are quick to forgive. We confess our sins, known and unknown, and we thank you, God, for your faithfulness to forgive us and to cleanse us of all unrighteousness. God, we thank you for breaking chains of offenses and chains of debt. We will move in the spirit. We will move effortlessly because we release unforgiveness and we receive your forgiveness. Draw us close to you, Father. We believe that we receive your forgiveness, and we believe that we receive your power to forgive others. Lead us not to unto temptation. Lord, deliver us from evil. We see evil manifesting in our land. Deliver us from evil in the name of Jesus. We know that we do not struggle against people, but we struggle against principalities and powers we struggle against the rulers of the darkness of this world yes. and spiritual wickedness in high places. So lift us above those limitations and those restrictions. We will see your will being done on this earth. We sever the ties of the enemy on any territory in spite of the wars that are going on and the lives that are being lost as well as property. We speak that there will be peace on this earth and we thank you that millions will be saved in the name of Jesus. Teach us, God, how to live and how to love one another. Teach us how to be good to one another so that we can overcome evil with good. Lift the burdens and the grieving hearts. Comfort your people. Make us to be a people of consistent prayer. Many are sowing in tears in this season, God, but we thank you that they will reap in joy. Let there be peace and love and order instead of war and hatred and killing. Father, we will sow love in our homes. We will sow love in our communities, our various communities in Jesus' name. We thank you, God, for spiritual breakthroughs in our homes and in our communities. Let there be laughter, God. Let there be love. That is what you require from us, that we love one another in the name of Jesus. Yours Amen. is the kingdom and yours is the power and the glory forever. No other kingdom will prevail but yours, God. No other kingdom will prevail in our homes. No other kingdom will prevail in our communities. No other kingdom will prevail in our world. No other kingdom will prevail in our churches and on our job. No other kingdom will prevail in any nation but the kingdom of our Lord Christ. So yours is the kingdom, yours is the power, and yours is the glory forever. Amen. It is so, and it is done in the name of Jesus. So let, his, let us give him praise. Let us hallelujah. give him honor. Yes, let us give him glory. Thank you, hallelujah. 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 Thank you for your power and your grace. Thank for you, your Lord God. Manifest blessings we thank you that yours us, is oh God. You are highly lifted hallelujah. up. Hallelujah. Oh God, we thank you that you will bring us where you are. You lift us up, oh God. And we thank you, oh Lord, for your goodness, your grace, your, your power, oh Lord. Every single thing that you are, we thank you right now. Hallelujah. We bless your name. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Answering prayer, answering prayer, answered prayer. We 
we thank you, say God. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to thank your name, you, Lord God. Jesus. We bless your name. We bless your name Hallelujah. this morning. Thank you, Lord. Jesus. God, and we thank you for this time of prayer. We thank everyone that joined us on this line, and we ask you to join us again tomorrow at 6 a.m. for another session of fasting, prayer, and consecration with Nava Harper Ministries. Have a blessed and godly day in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah.